the binoculars? Uh, yeah, I got the binoculars. Hey guys, I am Ever Cody and I just had a very good day. This morning, I went with my dad on a walk up to Wild Earth. And when I was going back, I saw a deal that was right in front and just ran off. The good thing about this is that they're afraid of people. And now, I was at um, this lake that I will at, what is the lake called again? Sailorville Lake. Sailorville. Oh, Sailorville. Well, um, this is a really nice lake, and it was so nice, and as you can see, it's a hillside, and not a hillside, it's just such a pretty scenery. Um, and tonight we're doing a bonfire. My mom, um, is, uh, um, she went on a vacation to Chicago. Oh, there's that same guy again. She went on a vacation to Chicago, a department vacation. And she is going to come back tomorrow at, um, 11, uh, 3.30 in the afternoon. Daddy, I don't want you eating Doritos in the car. It smells at the car. Daddy, don't eat any Doritos. Daddy, the smell is too much for me. Can you get rid of the smell, please? Oh, I can still smell it. So I'm going to open the doors to get the smell out. I don't like it when my uh, people are uh, um, eating garlicky food. So as you can see, we are leaving the uh, lake, as you can see. And so we went to the beach part of it, and I climbed on several rocks, and we looked at signs, trees, and biology. I have a science teacher, his name is Mr. Gala, and he is a straight out biology teacher, because um, it was really fun. You know, my mom has a lot of compromises, and when she gives compromises it interferes with the enjoyment because she says because I want to do something I want to go do this and she says no I have work to do this is a really big day and I get really frustrated and accepting is not in my book because I'm not the kind of person that accepts things because if I don't get what I want and I really want it then I take care of it for myself make myself happy. So, oh, what a shame. But anyway, you might, I mean, you might want to go slow. Fresh air, wonderful. I'm sure it is. Wasn't that fun, Daddy? Yeah. We're gonna come back with cameras and we're gonna dig a little deeper. sound when you're riding fast because the faster you go the more the sound is um, the louder the sound is and we were going on bridges the uh, um, the uh, sound of the road in the wind because it's concrete and concrete makes the sound and I don't know why it's just a true fact and Make a sound and so, uh, yeah. Yeah, so. Mommy's gonna come back tomorrow. Isn't it 
fall so wonderful. Yeah, it's best. Yeah, it, it's just really, it's just that kind of year where you want to get outdoors because summer's too hot. Just fall and spring are the type of seasons where you want to go on a lot of nature walk trails, and we went on a very short one. But of course, we did a lot of other things. So next time we come here, we're going to dig a little deeper into what this place really is. And I think that I've used this season wisely, and a good thing that will wrap up this, uh, on this season is going on a fall little trip. Because last time, uh, last season, we went to, uh, um, Madison County, we looked at covered bridges, and we had barbecue for lunch. Man, that was good. So, if I went there again, then I would be open up to education. And I really like cooking. And, uh, um, yeah, acting, recording, changing my voice, and a lot of other things as well. And... Basically, that's it. So as you can see, there is a winding loop in the road. You can see that beautiful scenery. I just hope I got a big deal. I think I did with all the other pictures. Now that is uh, a little. Um, I'm a little uh, um, preview of what um, we did today, and I hope that you look at the pictures. high level of math called calculus and then he was a uh, physics teacher I think that's the same thing is physics math daddy I was a physics teacher I taught math as well so you didn't teach science you just math no physics oh huh. so th physics is math correct no, physics is a different thing, but you need a certain kind of math to do physics. So I taught that kind of math. It's called mathematical physics. Oh. But it's really math. He would be math. a very advanced like teacher. Uh, my mom and my grandma and my grandpa are all the same in art. Because it's, it's art. My mom is an art teacher at Simpson College, a professor. And she, uh, she, um, is a very good art teacher. She teaches at Simpson College. And my grandpa has a studio, and he, uh, he goes down there in a studio, and he, uh, um, he paints in a studio. So, yeah. So this is really nice. You could um, really grow soybeans. And speaking of soybeans, I actually saw a soybean crop when we were um, on our last fall vacation in Madison County. Um, I actually saw soybeans. So you could really ac have acres of land. You know, going outdoors is healthy. And for me, it's a new world. And it gives a lot of comforting lines. Comforting lines are basically like memories that you want to experience again or from movies that you want to experience. If um, um, you want to know more about that, go to my website, uh, everettcody.com, and find out more information. You are never eating Doritos again in this car. Ever. <laughs> oh.